Planet Dolan. For most of us, the weirdest thing we'll see on a beach is when Grandad drops his towel. But what real mysteries have been uncovered in the sands? Will we ever explain how some of these things got here? Here are 15 most bizarre discoveries ever made on a beach. I'm Danger Dolan, and today I will be your narrator. Number 15. In the 19th century, sailors used to stop and rest on George's Island off the coast of Canada. One day, in 1876, a ship hit trouble nearby and the crew bailed out and headed for shore. Only one of the five survived to tell a tale, explaining to the fishermen who found him that their lifeboat had smashed on the rocks. However, a few weeks later, three headless bodies were found near the beach, along with two empty tents. A fourth man was discovered later with what looked like axe marks in his skull. The survivor was never traced. Number 14. Vincent Thurkettle discovered the biggest gold nugget ever found in the UK on the beaches of Wales in 2016. It's thought to belong to the whole of a 120 million pound ship called the Royal Charter that sunk in 1859. Vincent's nugget, worth about 50,000 pounds, wasn't exactly an accidental find though. He'd spent about six weeks hunting for seven years in a row, so he'd basically earn an annual salary. Number 13. When biologist Vreni Hossaman flew a chartered flight over Patagonia in Chile, she was there to study a variety of life. What she didn't expect to find was the largest mass whale death ever seen. 337 whales were found washed up in the fjords, with many of them already very decayed, so they'd obviously been there for some time. The cause of death is unknown, but some other mass whale deaths have been due to a bloom of toxic microorganisms that can occur naturally in the oceans. Number 12. Another creepy mystery on the Canadian coast now, and part of the US coast too. On the beaches of the Salish Sea, almost 20 human feet were discovered over a period of 10 years. For the most part, they are right feet, although a few pairs have been found. A lot of the feet have decayed in a way that made them very hard to identify, but it's thought that they are from a variety of sources. It's also natural for the feet to detach if a body's in the water for some time. Some feet came with stolen sneakers, thought to be victims from the 2004 tsunami, having washed across the ocean. Others, local suicides. Number 11. A quiet seaside town on the south coast of the UK was understandably alarmed when they heard that traces of strontium-90, a highly radioactive substance, had been found on the beach. Although the levels were well below anything dangerous, it's not what you want to hear when you live three miles from the Sizewell nuclear power plant. The traces could be from one of the shutdowns of the reactors, could also be from some other source, such as the Fukushima or Chernobyl disasters. Number 10. The Schmidt family are professional treasure hunters, and they finally hit a major payday in 2015 when they found a million dollars worth of old Spanish gold coins just off the beaches of Florida. In their hole was 51 coins, 12 meters of gold chain, and a specially commissioned coin made for King Philip V. If you want a bit of booty of your own, the find is from a whole fleet that went down in 1715, and it's estimated that there's still a half a billion dollars down there. Number 9. A whole oil tanker washed up on a beach in Liberia, but all of the crew and the lifeboats are gone. The ship was registered in Panama, but it's not known what happened to the crew. Pirates operate in the area, but since oil prices have dropped, these tankers have become much less of a target. It was also speculated that the captain might not have enough money to pay the crew, so they just bailed. Number 8. Police were called in Sydney, Australia, when an expensive Maserati was found abandoned on a popular beach. But it turns out the owner was just nearby, he got the car worth around 250000 bucks stuck in the sand. He then played some golf and had a swim. Police decided he needed to go to a hospital to get checked out, suspecting that his comments about a recent breakup might mean he was actually having a small breakdown. Number 7. At the start of the 20th century, the Mexican government carried out weapons testing on the Mariata Islands off the west coast. One bomb test collapsed the rock in a large circle, it's created one of the most unique beaches in the world where there is now a narrow tunnel letting in the crystal blue water and a perfect white sandy beach hidden in a circle of rock. It's now known as Love Beach and has become a popular tourist hotspot for anyone who can get there. Number 6. In 1992, a huge shipping crate full of yellow bath time rubber ducks washed aboard somewhere in the Atlantic. There were 29,000 of them. While adding more plastic to the ocean is never a good thing, the ducks have actually proved incredibly useful for science since they showed us the path to ocean currents as the ducks ended up washing ashore all over the world. They've been found on beaches on the east coast of the US, Chile, the UK, Australia and Iceland. They were so helpful in fact that scientists are offering 50 bucks for any discovered. 
Number five. In late 2016, the beaches of Nova Scotia, Canada were suddenly filled with beached animals. There was a huge variety with everything from seals to lobsters, starfish and a variety of fish. The cause is still unknown, but the most likely is that the seismic movement created an earthquake and released a pocket of poisonous gas. Number four. A number of bodies were found in burlap sacks along Gilgo Beach in the state of New York, as well as other areas nearby. They're believed to have been down to a serial killer who mainly targeted sex workers from the website Craigslist. This has given the unidentified killer the nickname the Craigslist Ripper, as well as the Long Island serial killer. Ten bodies were found from 2010, and another six may also tie to the case. Number three. Martin Kelly here was out walking his dogs on the seashore in Ireland when he came across two dildos. However, this wasn't the first time. He also seen some appear the year before. Small fishing port town seems an unlikely destination for an outdoor sex party. Martin said he rang his wife when he found them, but that she told him she wasn't interested. Number two. In 2011, the shores of Alaska started turning a very unusual color. Mysterious orange goo collected in huge banks on the beaches. It was first thought to be the eggs of crustaceans, with the fat inside causing the orange color. It's now believed to be a fungus called rust, but analysis has been difficult. It may be a new species of life form. Number one. One of the creepiest discoveries was at Montauk, New York in 2008. A carcass was found, about the size of an average dog. It didn't look like any known animal. It was named the Montauk Monster, and the only evidence are photographs. The body was never examined. Most experts think it was either a hoax or possibly a slightly decomposed raccoon. So guys, what's the weirdest thing you've ever heard about wash up on a beach? Let us know in the comment section down below. We'll pin our favorite to the top. That is it for this countdown. Have a good one!